Hi everyone, I'm L.V. Miller, my dad Ora, and my mom Orpha. So mom has quilted this, uh, this quilt for the auction, to sell at the auction. And this is what she does, handmade quilt. What's the name of this quilt? Star Spin. Star Spin. Okay, so uh, this is a star spin, she says. And she has quilted up to this point it was big like this. What, what size is it? My dad says it's a queen size. So it was out here, and then she rolls it in with the, the, this, these. We unclamp this and roll it in as she moves that way. So now I'm going to help them. She usually needs a little bit of help to get this rolled together. So, Mom, I'm going to help you roll this in. So we're going to roll this. Dad's going to help me roll this in for you. You can stay there if you want, Mom. And we're going to help her roll this quilt together, so she because she's finished to this to this point yeah, in here. Put your leg on here so that this won't slip. Right. Yeah. Okay. So there's a technique to this. I'm going to roll it together. No, but you have to have. Yeah. This quilt will be auctioned at the auction on May 15, 2021. So if you see this video after that date, it's already been sold. If you, you see the video before that date. You should come and bid on it. And you must be present at the auction in order to bid on it. So in 1980, she started quilting. And then we had the auction started soon after that, like the yeah. early 80s, 82, 83, mm -hmm. somewhere in there. And and she'd been quilting ever since. We had only had one quilt at the first auction. She's the one who quilted it. She's never missed an auction since then. So what Dad said is she had the, the one and only quilt at the first auction in the early 1980s, the only quilt. And then from that point on, other people began contributing quilts to the auction. And so her quilt consistently brings the highest money at the auction, which has been a real blessing for her mom. We don't know how many more years that she can continue to uh, quilt for the auction. You know, hopefully many years, but we don't know. And every, every year we think maybe it's the last one that she can quilt, but we hope it'll be a while, but it's beautiful and she does an amazing job of it. And we hope, uh, look forward to seeing you at the auction and, and the lucky person is gonna end up with this quilt. It'll be a collector's item. And uh, to us, it's very special that she can do this still. She's 86 years young and uh, look at her quilt. She's, she knows, I don't know how she does that. It takes her a while, but she gets it done. So, Dad, did she piece all these together? No, no she, so she, that, she had she she had this done. First. She used to she used put to them all. The, she yeah. used to put all these together herself. But now she gets the pieces done, and then she quilts every uh, every seam. She quilts everything by hand, the entire quilt. The quilt top was made, and then she. She follows the lines. Look at this design. Did somebody else draw that on Leona there? Leona did all this here. So my sister Leona drew the pattern here on here with lead. And then she follows the line. Then at the first washing, I guess, then the lead will wash out, right? Mm -hmm. Is the idea. This is just beautiful. The coloring is amazing. You're, you're, uh, Quilts are beautiful, Mom. She gave all of us children a quilt. We have one on our bed that we have that she made for us, which is very special. But not not this pattern. I don't remember what the pattern was in ours, but they're all beautiful. So we'll see you at the auction and go ahead and enjoy her uh, quilting a little bit here. She does it a few minutes at a time and rest, so we won't make her go too long. Thank you for watching.